Hey, what's up guys? Ron Gilak, Home Business Coach here. And today I want to answer a question that I actually get really frequently. And it's, what is your daily routine for network marketing? Now, I've actually answered this question many times before and I've got a couple of different blog posts on specifically on this subject, even like timing out from like the moment I wake up till about I go to bed, what am I doing to build my business? And here's what I've found with a lot of people that um, ask this question. Um, and I'm just gonna be real, real frank, real, real with this. It's not the daily routine that matters. It's not the how-to that matters. It's not waking up and every single morning, uh, you know, do, doing your affirmations, making you know your perfect breakfast, working out, and then do like that whole routine um, is not the the secret magic, you know, success cocktail um, to to get you there because. To be like just super real with you, I don't do all that stuff every day. I don't do affirmations every day. I don't read personal development um, every day. And like, despite some of that stuff, God still blesses me. And like, currently, I'm the number one affiliate inside of my Lead System Pro. I've got uh, more coaching clients than I know what to do with. And like, everything's going well in my internet business. And I don't do all those things. I don't even have the same routine every every day. And here's something that I learned. It's not the how-to that really matters so much. It's having a vision. The Bible says that without vision, the people perish, right? Um, so without vision, the people perish. And here's what I found. When you have a vision of who of who you want to become, when you make it a when you have a purpose and a vision of who you want to become and who do you want to impact, how do you want to actually change the world? When you start getting to that level of of past, like I just want to pay my bills, I just want to make money, I want to live comfortably, I want to drive a nice car. Like once you get past those those lo what I'll call lower level visions, um, and you have a purpose to impact, to inspire, to motivate, to transform. To have that kind of effect on people, it doesn't matter what you wake up and what you plan, what your daily routine is. You know that you wake up and boom, you're fired up, and you say, "Can't wait to get get to it. Can't wait to get to work. Can't get. Can't wait to get to my computer. Can't wait to hit the phones. Whatever it is, your business is whatever niche. What it is? Maybe you're in ministry. Like whatever. Whatever it is that you're doing, you know that you have an extreme fire fire built. Uh, passion and purpose for what you're doing it's because you've expanded your vision right you've expanded your vision so much that it just unconsciously pulls you it just unconsciously pulls you towards the dreams that you want to experience the manifestation of those because your vision is so real you've connected it so real to your purpose your daily routine doesn't matter you just wake up and do it right I don't know what I'm gonna do everything I know some things I'm gonna do tomorrow I don't know the majority of them though Life is an adventure, right? So here's the other thing. If you know what your vision is and you continue to play small and not do the activities that you know you need to do to get you there, it causes pain. <laughs> it causes frustration. It causes anxiety. It causes stress because you know deep down inside you that you're purposely playing small because you're allowing fear to control you. That might cut some of you. Because you're allowing fear to control you. And here's the other reality. If you're watching this video, I just exposed that truth for you. This should make you real uncomfortable because now you have a choice. All right, hopefully you thank me for this one day. But now you have a choice to either choose to move forward and have that vision start pulling you, right? A uh, guy I know, Reverend Michael Beckwith, who's a friend of my buddy uh, Ray Higdon's, says that pain pushes and vision pools. So the pain of staying small and complacent and not having the impact, not living the life that you know you should, even if it is lower level right now, just paying your bills, taking care of your family, driving a nice car, whatever, whatever it is for you, that pain is gonna start pushing you until you're so uncomfortable, until you're so frustrated that you're sick and tired of being sick and tired and you get off your ass and you do something. Pain pushes, vision pulls, daily routine does not matter. A little bit. A little bit it matters. Develop a stronger vision 
is your answer and your daily routine is going to evolve and emerge for you because you will begin to know what a person of impact does. You want to empower people, you want to impact, you want to inspire, you want to motivate, you want to, sh you want to transform. What does that person do? The vision is of who you can become, the person you become on, that, on the way to having uh, like worldwide impact, to having to being, a, <laughs> to being a dreamer and actually making that come to fruition, become that person, your daily routine won't matter. So I hope this video um, really cut you, right? Try to be real with you, make you a little uncomfortable today. Leave me a comment below in this video. What did you get out of this video today? Love to hear you. God bless.